in my 30s and 40s, had a real obsession with fancy restaurants. I was invited to a party first by, from this producer I was working with uh, at her house. And the only reservation I was able to get at this place was 10.30, the 10.30 seating, which is the very last seating. So I go to this party. I'm there for a number of hours. And it's like a Bellini party. So she's made these Bellinis, you know, which is mm. you know, peach juice and, and Prosecco. And they hand me one. I was like, oh, I'm just going to you know, take it easy because I want to go have this meal with, with the wine pairing. So I'm drinking these Bellinis, but it's kind of part of where you're talking to people and waiters are coming around and they're just filling your glass yeah. as you're talking. So you don't realize it. Yeah. And of course, I'm just kind of in the moment. So I think I probably down about 10 or 11 wow. Bellinis. Yeah. And Bellinis go down very yeah, easy. Very easy. Well. Yes. They're, they're kind of like fruit punch. Yeah. 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 So you're like, oh, that's fine. And they're practically good for you. They are. They yeah. are. They're actually, it's a healthy drink. Yeah. So, you know, so it's like, oh, I got to go to this. I got to get to the restaurant. So I just kind of get there. And I'm like, oh, I'm feeling, I'm feeling them a little bit. <laughs> and so I order the big meal and I do it with the wine pairing. So first thing comes out, like, oh, this is good. This wine's really good. And they kind of do big pours on the glasses. So I'm eating all this. And I'm like, suddenly like, oh man, I'm really tired. And then so kind of like, oh, and I, kind of my eyes kind of shut and I wake up and there's like a different course in front of me and a different glass of wine. I'm like, oh, okay, so I'm going to eat and do this stuff. And then I'm like, oh, kind of fall asleep <laughs> again and wake up like, oh, and there's another <laughs> plate in front of me. But then there's like a big wine stain on the, on the, on the table and like a glass is tipped over. And I'm like, oh, oh God, oh, it's, uh, who knocked over the wine? <laughs> And I just keep having these things and like time is compressing and I'm just kind of like, oh, like going to feel myself nod off, wake up. I look and, and I kind of people are, are watching the table <laughs> and there's another big wine stain on the ta tablecloth. And so the, I'm kind of and then I'm like, oh, I should write my wife because she was back in, in, in the States. And so I had my Blackberry at the time. And so I like, I'm typing her a thing. I'm like, oh, I'm having this really nice meal, blah, blah, blah. And then wake up again. <laughs> and all, all of a sudden, then I, somebody from the hotel comes over. <laughs> it is next to the table. And, and they're like, uh, are you Mr. Feig? Um, your wife is very concerned. <laughs> I said, why? And I look at the text I sent. And it's like, BXR, blah, 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 <laughs> like just blibbity, blah, blah, bloob. <laughs> <laughs> it's like oh no <laughs> so i was literally just passing out on the table and like sitting like somebody's grandfather and knocking over shit <laughs> and um yeah but the waiters were just like coming they, over they, they instead were, of going it might be time to put this guy in a car home or we'll try and contact his next of kin they were like let's just wake him up and get another call no that was like the it. other thing they were literally just I, it was like you know like i uh, felt like pg wodehouse or something yeah. like, sir you know just put sir, <laughs> another thing in front of the sir so whatever would happen they would just come dutifully clear it away and put the next thing down but then i kind of noticed them and they're all kind of watching with kind of these stifled laughs on their faces so i think everybody found it very amusing <laughs> yeah this guy was just, yeah. just passing out on the table <laughs> maybe they had bets on which course you'd get to before you actually just collapsed onto the floor i reckon he can get to the desserts no no no, no. he's out by course eight. Yeah, exactly oh i remember the yeah. bill going, oh yeah, thank yeah, you yeah. so much and then trying to like extract myself gracefully oh my god and i think there was i know it was filled up my shirt and so um <laughs> there you go so that was the uh the tale of tale of my fancy meal and that's why you can't remember the name of the restaurant that, that, I honestly suspect you haven't been back i blanked it out <laughs> yeah. i i even i can't i when we walk down that side of the street past that restaurant i'm sure they might they have a picture of me passed out on the table so Ooh. that's that's a new logo for the, yeah. when they do that kind of fancy line drawing yeah. it's me face down <laughs> So, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Tales of drunkenness. <laughs>